Hey guys, we are back in fabulous Las Vegas. We are at the Luxor Hotel and Casino at the HyperX Arena. So the HyperX Arena is a video gaming arena, I guess, that hosts video game competitions and allows you to rent a computer space just to play and hang out they serve food and drinks here they are a multi-story arena with a stage as you can see there so when you're having a competition the competitors will sit on top of the stage and here I am on the second floor now in the VIP area. The VIP area is able to be rented for events as well. And like I said, they serve food and drinks and the waitress will bring you your items. So you can rent a computer space for $15 an hour. And if you're a local, they give you double time. So the Luxor was opened in 1993 and is a 30-story casino hotel on the southern end of the Las Vegas Strip. It is operated by MGM Resorts. And you guys, the place looks huge from the inside. From the outside, it doesn't look that big, but once you get in there, it is pretty large. Now, you guys, this is the home to America's Got Talent, Las Vegas Live, The Blue Man Group, and Carrot Top, as well as the Bodies Exhibition and the Titanic Artifact, which, if you stay tuned, I will show you later on in the video. It has over 4,000 rooms, you guys. This is a big, big hotel. Now, has anybody heard that the Luxor is haunted, or is it just me? Because I have heard tons and tons of stories about the Luxor being haunted, bad things happening here. You guys, if you hear any stories or know of any stories, leave them in the comments because I am super curious because all I did was hear about bad things with the Luxor. Luckily, I didn't stay there. I was just there to see the HyperX Arena and go through the VIP tour. But I did take a look around. And you guys, if you know of any stories, leave them in the comments. Enjoy the rest of the video. As always, stay traveling. You guys, inside the Luxor, is the Titanic artifact exhibit which um, I do recommend Fascinating exhibitions, allowing people to experience her story and those of her passengers through the recovery of ship artifacts and personal belongings. The effort to recover and preserve these relics has been monumental. It has taken seven deep sea recovery missions, tens of millions of dollars, and countless man hours, not to mention the risk of many lives. Cutting edge technology like manned submersibles designed to probe the ocean depths two and a half miles beneath the ocean's surface, sought artifacts in the chaos of the wreckage. Once an artifact was discovered, robotic arms extended to carefully retrieve the object in a collection basket and return it to.